Here we have a 1956 Fairlane convertible Sunliner. And we are here with John. John Elvis here. Um, I hear you have Porter mufflers on this car. Uh, how do you like them? Yes, I do. We put them on. Dave Abler put them on uh, a couple of years ago. And they're the nicest sound of mufflers on the road, I'd say. They're quiet when they should be quiet, and they wrap a little when you want them to. So, so I'm standing here with Nate in his 1960 Impala, and he has Porter mufflers. What exactly do you like about those? I like that sweet, traditional sound that I get out of them, and I like the fact that they're an era-correct muffler, and it gives me that era-correct sound from back in the day. A fancy truck here, and it's got a porter muffler on it. My name is Elvis. Yes. What made you get a porter muffler? I wanted the 1950s sound, just like in high school. So uh, I'm a retired teacher, and I had a truck before this one, and had a sweet sound, and I wanted to get that same sound again. I'm standing here with Dick and his 29 Chevy four-door sedan, and he's got Porter mufflers. Why don't you tell me a little bit about that? Well, I like the sound of them. I think they're great, and uh, I found out about them back to the 50s, and uh, I've been dealing with Clark for about a year with them, and uh, I think they're, the sound is great on them, and they, they look like they're going to last a long time, and uh, I just like them. And here we have a 1960 Cadillac, my kind of car. Uh, Phil, is it? Yes. Uh, Elvis here. Nice to meet you. Uh, what possessed you to uh, buy a Cadillac? It was just low and long and gorgeous. Oh. Ask for more than that, can you? No. And uh, what kind of mufflers do you use? I use Porter. Oh. Well, Cadillac needs a little bit of a sound, but not enough sound that, that it's loud and kind of out of character, but enough sound to get you to question about is it stock or isn't it? Perfect sound. So it purrs like a kitten, but it growls like a tiger. There you go. All right. Well, thank you.